EA Sports and the PGA Tour proudly present the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. Today, it's live opening round coverage of the International Challenge. Frank, through the years, there have been some great winners at the Open Championship played at Royal Troon. Well, just in recent uh, history, remember Mark Kalkovec here in the playoff with Wayne Grady and Greg Norman. Um, there was also Todd Hamilton when he beat Ernie Els in the four-hole playoff. And back in 1996, Justin Leonard was to win his Open Championship. Tom Watson also won an Open Championship here. Tom Weisskopf, his only major, that was 1973. The great Arnold Palmer, Bobby Locke, they all won at Royal Troon. That's a good start to the hole, right down the middle. Second shot, good look at the green. Should be safely on deck. What a display of shot making this has been, Frank. Oh, the incredible approach shot there. The easiest of birdies coming up. Even par currently. Frank, how much does that birdie help the cause? Well, it doesn't look like much right now, Rich. Just sneaking inside the top 20. But at the end of the day, that might be the one that turned the tide. Back to the action here as we get ready to tee off at the par 3 eighth. Yeah, five bunkers surround this green that's perched up. The two really to avoid, they're on the right side. They're incredibly deep pot bunkers. Frank had hit the green, but just didn't have enough backspin. But, uh, you wonder what he's thinking on that. Good shot right there. Really not much to this. The only issue would be a lack of concentration or focus. Been a little too much of that, Frank. Just sort of ho-hum pars. Frank, the ninth hole, 423 yards, not especially long by today's standards. You looking to make birdie here, or are you happy to make a par and move on to the back nine? Well, there's certainly a chance for birdie. One of the hardest things about the ninth is the raised green. Um, and it's sort of, there's two tiers here, just the top level. If that pin is on the top, t top level, then you would certainly walk away with four very happily. Excellent line, propped up on the short grass. 135 yards to the hole and sitting nicely in the fairway. He makes a great pass at the golf ball. It's powerful, but it's rhythmic at the same time. Wow, really off the mark. Missed the green here.
Once considered the best player at the college level, our featured golfer makes birdie sitting comfortably inside the cut line. Well, that was a nearly flawless performance on the front side, but Frank, we know it's an 18-hole game, isn't it? That's right. Now's not the time to pat yourself on the back. Good tee shot, right in the short grass. Frank, this is a position where a player is absolutely licking his chops here. Good chance to make a birdie. Yeah, this is when this game just looks like fun. Bunkers don't seem to be in play. The only thing you're really looking at right now is just the flag. Seems to like it. Looks like it's headed for the green. Early part of this back nine and a good approach shot. And now we'll have this for birdie. You don't want to let this one get away. This is about concentration and focus at this point. Well, that would have been a bonus had it gone in, but still, reasonable chance for par here. Yeah, there's no damage. Uh, you're not going to birdie every hole. Trying to move on with a par in his pocket. Nice par to remain at two under. Frank, if you needed a reminder as to just how difficult this 11th hole is, none other than Jack Nicklaus had his problems here. Yeah, he turned pro in 1962. He just won the U.S. Open at Oakmont, and then he came to Troon, and on the 11th hole, he made a 10. That's right, double digits. Yeah. Game's about rhythm. It, when you have good rhythm, it just looks effort, effortless. To hit the ball 300 yards through the air, that easy. From a perfect position, ready to play his next shot. What a nice shot, right on the green and a pretty easy putt on the way. These putts keep the round together. That's an important birdie right there, into the top five on this leaderboard. Well, there's so much at stake this week, Richard. Back here on the bonny shores of Scotland at Royal Troon Golf Club with just a wee breeze, as they say over here, Frank. On the tee at the 12th. Yeah, hold it bends to the right, uh, gorse right and left. There's a bit of a mound and rough down the right side that has to be avoided. Pretty good drive here. Another straight one. They'll be happy with that in the fairway. Now a good chance to attack this hole. Ready for a second shot, trying to knock it on the green. That's well played. Places it about 10 feet out for birdie. Been pretty good all day from this distance. Just trying to take care of business.
Frank, this is a good position to be in for a player. Making birdies, making some moves. Yeah, starting to get the momentum, too, for the finish. There you have it, Frank. First round is complete. What are your thoughts, partner? Rich, I think anyone inside the, the current top ten of that leaderboard is certainly well-placed to go on and uh, take this championship.